Here it is, KJ4 coming at you from Lake Charles, Louisiana, talking about the last game in Mosaic Stadium. Wow. Then it's on to the beautiful new stadium. Man, I remember coming into that place in 2003 as a, a rookie into the CFL and coming in as a visitor on that visiting sideline. That was a tough place to play. At the time, it was called Taylor Field. Uh, being on the AstroTurf, that was always a hostile environment to play in. But old 2006 came around and I became a part of the Saskatchewan Rough Riders. And what an awesome time. What an awesome place. Man, it reminds you of so much excitement and college atmosphere when you come around the stadium on game day and you see all the fans tailgating. Uh, it was just great. You know, I have a lot of fond memories from there. Uh, and then, of course, it changes over to Mosaic Stadium, which it is now. And just, just thinking about the times that we had and the games that we had in that stadium, it's just, it's just a great place, and it's going to be a place that's going to be truly missed. But I tell you what, I know it's going to be a lot of excitement in the new stadium. But as I think back and think back about that 2007 season and the, just a wonderful run that we had in that stadium, when you talk about the Labor Day Classic, when you talk about the, Edmonton, the game with the Edmonton Eskimos, when the blackout, when the lights went out, we came back and won that game. I mean, it just goes on and on and on. Then having the opportunity to win a playoff game against the Calgary St. Peters, go on to win the Grey Cup in 2007. But I think another uh, another great memory that I will always hold on to is coming back there, walking into that stadium, going on the stage in front of thousands of fans on a cold, chilly day to hold up that trophy and say, here it is to the province of Saskatchewan, the people of Regina, the fans of Regina, and say, here's your third Grey Cup championship. I think that was a great moment. And just see teammates like uh, Gene Makowski, uh, Jeremy O'Day, uh, guys that have just been grinding and grinding over and over to just celebrate those uh, those wonderful moments when th with those guys, the Yo Murphys, the uh, Corey Grant, DJ Flick. Uh, the list can go on and on and on. Corey Holmes, I just think we had a – great family we had a great coaching staff and I thought Kent Austin did a great job of leading the way and being our leader and the staff that he had together to allow us to accomplish the goal that we had set out for so to all the fans I know we're going to miss Mosaic Stadium it's been a lot of great memories uh, even after the 2007 uh, getting that fourth great cup it's just been great you know and to see my man Double D just leading the team over and over I know it's been a tough year but you know what Everything works out for the good. It's going to be better next year, and it's going to be a great opportunity when it's time to open that new one up. But uh, to all the fans of Saskatchewan, to Taylor Field, the old Taylor Field, Mosaic Stadium, to the Ryder fans, to the Riders, man, it's a great ride and great memories in that, in that stadium. God bless y'all. I wish y'all the best on this weekend. I will be following and see what the results are going to be. And we look forward to opening up that new stadium. And I shall be back to Regina in the province of Saskatchewan to see a game in that new stadium.